Hey guys, tomorrow is K-State's first uh, game of the season and it is against an FCS team, Eastern Kentucky. Uh, and Eastern Kentucky is an average team because they went 6-5 and five last year without making the playoffs. Uh, well guys, I have to say this should be a blowout because Eastern Kentucky is an average team. Uh, an, an average FCS team and we have real good luck against FCS teams uh, this should be a blowout uh, if we take them seriously and not overlook them it should be a blowout so I don't know the depth chart for the game tomorrow is really that I the only thing I seen of the depth chart was that uh, that uh, uh, Bryce Brown is third in line at uh, might be third string quarterback running back sorry running back because uh, the problems he had him and his brother had during the off season but I'm not sure that's true or not I just seen it on their website but that's all I've seen about the depth chart because that's all I've seen uh, he could be the starter tomorrow but I seen that was that he might be third a third string quarter running back for a while, but that not be not might be true, not be true. Uh, he, uh, I predict him going to be the first string quarter running back tom tomorrow. Uh, I think Colin Klein will be the starting quarterback tomorrow uh, with Justin Tuggle as a backup. So. My keys to the game for tomorrow are are number one have a have a good throwing game. Start with the start having a good throwing game early in the season. You don't need to start having a good throwing game in the middle of the season. We just cannot just rely on the running game. Seriously, we just cannot just rely on the running game. We need to start having a good th passing game as well. So, key one: start having a have a good throwing game. Start early in the season, not in the middle of it. So that's my first key. Second key to the game is stop the run. Last year, we were horrendous at stopping the run. I think we gave up almost 300 yards rushing last year on defense. We were second to last out of 120 to stop the run last year. That's horrendous. So we need to improve on our rushing defense. So key two, stop the run. And key three, uh, don't overlook Kentucky. Like I said earlier, don't overlook them because they... Uh, FCS schools has some recent history against good history against uh, FBS schools. Just ask Michigan. Just ask Kansas. They can tell you FCS teams can beat you once in a while. And just ask Virginia Tech as well. They can tell you if they if they overlook if we overlook them, they can beat you. So don't overlook Eastern Kentucky. So that's my three game, keys to the game for tomorrow's game against Eastern Kentucky. Uh, the game time, uh, I don't know if I said it already, but the game time for the game is 6 o'clock p.m. Central Time. The game's on TV. I'm not sure what channel it will be on. So it will be on TV for the 6 o'clock p.m. kickoff Central Time. Uh, my prediction for the game is K-State wins in a blowout. <coughs> Excuse me. So, my prediction is a blowout. We win 56-10. to 10. Well, I think we'll get about 10 points to them if we go overlook them. So, excuse me. My prediction is 56-10. to 10, so, this is, so, this is about it for me. So, go State and Ema.